Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Back to the Future of the Game for more point and click adventure game action. We are right back where we left off in this um, Hill Valley Science Expo. And we've got a couple of things we need to do. Um, <coughs> we have spoken to everybody in this room. So we need to check out some of these exhibition stalls. We've got the tickets in our invent, which Trixie gave to us. And we've also got to get this to the dock as well. Well, to Emmett. And last we heard, Emmett was off being taken somewhere by Citizen Brown Dock, as I was all, well, as I like to call him. Uh, so we've got to find out what's going on there as well. So where do we start? I guess just because I like to do things in a nice and tidy order. I think we'll start by the door and just make our way around the room. Um, so there's this glass house turnstile. Let's stick a ticket in there. And we are in our first exhibition stall or stand or whatever. <clears throat> Modular living space of the future. Hmm. No one in here. Ah, now I did see... <coughs> uh, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> don't know what's going on there. My voice is um, a little bit dry. I did see Cubal going into there. I don't know if we have to wait for him to go in there or something. So maybe we'll try the house of the future. And if we see him make a move back to there, let's um, head in. Welcome There's no one in there for now. Uh, okay, so we've got a console here, a potted plant, entertainment center, uh, and that's it. What's the deal with the plant? This plant doesn't belong here. There's nothing futuristic about it. Oh, okay. So that wasn't Flowers supposed to be there. The future, just like a regular potted plant, only fake. Oh, I wonder if we can swap that with that one over at the police booth. And then get the one that can record things. That might be something we can do, right? Let's take a look at this. Fully equipped home entertainment center. So where's the ColecoVision? I don't understand that reference. Uh, red button, green button, blue button. Let's press the red one, I guess. <laughs> that would be funny. Ah, oh, it's wax. Okay, so it's wax fruit. Well, they got that wrong, didn't they? <laughs> right, the green button. What does this do? Whoa. Hey. I mean, we do have headphones and earphones. Ah, we did see. Can we ring the Brown Estate? And we've got the phone booth of the future as well. Klondike 4385. Brown residence. Hey, Hampton. How's it hanging? This is Marty, Emmett's friend. Is he there? Not at the moment. I'm afraid he's off on one of his little adventures. Thanks. Bye. Farewell. Conversation terminated. Right, so I wonder if we've got a ring the again, mortals. This is Techni Muse of Progress. Hoping you're all having a swell time taking in all the exhibits. Don't forget, you can purchase tickets to our main attractions right here at the information booth. Oh, one's down, okay. Uh does that mean we need to get a move on? So let's try ring in the phone booth, right? Because we did get the number for that in the last episode. Please recite the phone number you wish to dial, or say hang up to terminate your phone helmet experience. All right, ring the phone booth as a future. Four two five three. Hill Valley Expo, where the future is coming today. This is Checkney News of Progress. To whom am I speaking? Uh, Carl Sagan. Kid Tannen. Uh. This is Carl Sagan. Ooh, 
with the mysterious Mr. Sagan. What do you want? Uh, can I talk to Edna or Emmett? Could you get Emmett for me? Oh, I would, Mr. Sagan, but I can't see the kid nowhere. In fact, the last time I saw him, he was with you. Oh, yes, right. Hang on. Conversation terminated. It's kind of annoying you can't... So that's a fruit basket one, that's a foam button. What's this blue button? We'll go back to that in a minute. Chinese checkers and everything. Huh. Right, so that didn't really do anything. <clears throat> so I'm guessing we're gonna have to get the right combination here. Phone conversations will be completed in the privacy of the personal phone helmet. Please recite the experience. Yeah, okay, we'll skip all the crap. Yeah, ring ring. Hill Valley Expo, Technis. Uh Kid Tannen, let's try that. It's Kid Tannen. I'm out of jail, and I want you back, baby. I don't know who you are or why you're doing that horrible impersonation of Kid, but that part of my life is over. I've gone legit. <laughs> Conversation terminated. Good for you, Trixie. Well, at least we know that. Um... In the house of the future, please resilience. What's the deal with the music there? Wanda... Jeez, always with the phones. Yeah? Uh, right. It's Carl it's Sagan. Me, Carl. Oh, hi, Mr. Sagan. What can I do for you? Can I talk to Edna? Can you put Edna Strickland on the phone for me? Sure thing, Mr. Sagan. Hey, Strickland! Somebody actually wants to talk to you. <laughs> Mr. Sagan, I didn't expect to hear from you again till after the expo. You didn't? Yes. How did she Wasn't know who it was? Plan? Yes, our plan. Uh, about that plan. Uh, tell me about our plan. Where's Emmett? Lay off Yakov Smirnov. Uh, where's Emmett? I seem to have momentarily lost track of Emmett. Do you have any idea where I might find him? You lost him? You were supposed to keep him distracted. Oh, I have been. He's just uh, wandered off. Well, go look for him. I've got my hands full with Parker. Uh, tell me about our plan. I'm a little unclear on the details of our plan. Unclear? But it's your plan. I mean, I'm worried Damn. that you're a little unclear on the details. What details? All I'm supposed to do is use my poll with Detective Parker to get Emmett's demonstration cancelled while you keep Emmett distracted. You are keeping him distracted, aren't you? Well, oh, yes. that's what we thought was the plan. Young man. Oh, that's what I keep telling everyone. Uh, the plans have changed. There's been a change of plan. What? Yes, I've changed my mind. I think we should let Emmett go through with his demonstration. But, but you told me it could be dangerous and that Yakov Smirnov was a foreign agitator. That the only way I could get Emmett back would be to scoop him up after his dreams were shattered and... and yes, and... yes, yes. Wow. I said a lot of things, but I was a little crazy at the time. The important thing is, now I think you should let Emmett go ahead with his little demonstration. Oh, I get it. What? It's Comrade Smirnov, isn't it? He's gotten to you. No! I really want Emmett to go ahead with his demo. Don't worry, Carl. You can count on me. Uh, lay off Yakov Smirnov. Why are you saying all those terrible things about Emmett's friend? Young comrade Smirnov? You were the one who told me about his vile deeds. Uh, let Emmett go through with his fight. Edna, his flight. Listen even. to me. You have to let Emmett go through with his demonstration. Smirnov's listening, isn't he? Oh, listen. Listen, Smirnov. I don't know what you're holding over Mr. Sagan, but there's no way I'm ever letting that Damn. contraption <clears throat> you've talked my Emmett into building get off the ground. <gasps> uh, your dark secret. Regarding, uh, you know what? You know what? Uh, the little matter we were whispering about yesterday. Oh, that? As a matter of fact, I'm glad you brought it up. I was thinking. Wouldn't it be a good idea to pin it all on Yakov Shmirnov? Uh, uh, uh what? what? On him, exactly. You know, it! Oh, What's it? I get it. You're still sore about going to jail. Uh, well, that was the dog's fault. If he hadn't come glumping up to me right after I started the fire, I could have gotten caught <gasps> away. And I never would have had to divert She started the you. fire. She's the speakeasy arsonist. Carl, is somebody with you? No, it's just you and me. 
Why did you burn him down? I pry, but why did you burn down all those speakeasies? Why? Because no one else was doing anything about them. So she's the arsonist. Well, we should Interesting. probably get back to the plan. Yes, we should. Goodbye, Mr. Sagan. Goodbye. Hang up. Conversation terminated. So, okay. Interesting. I did not see that coming. Uh, can we do anything to the I clock? I can't tell what time it is, but I know it's getting late. So, my theory is we've got to swap this plant with this other plant, the right? Ratings. So that we've got oh, this of... this one that can record things. Hill Valley. Yoink! Nothing weird going on here. Right, so can we use that to somehow get Edna to incriminate herself? That's what I'm wondering. Welcome to the world of tomorrow, where a man's home is truly his castle. So can we use... Yeah, we know about that. Can we use this recording device on this console? Uh. I don't think so. No. Uh, can we use the recording device on the green button? Maybe not. Hmm, okay. In the house of the future, phone conversations will be completed in the privacy of the personal phone help. Please resilience. Uh, phone booth of the future. Yeah. yeah, always with the phone calls, we know. Uh, let's try Michael Corleone. It's me, Michael. Oh, hi. What can I do for you? Oh, uh, nothing. I was just checking out this snazzy phone. Okay, bye. Bye. Conversation terminated. Hmm. Okay. Detective Parker's secret police recorder. Just like a regular potted plant, but with a recorder inside. Can we perhaps put this somewhere, then? Like, maybe up on the shelf Not or something? sure what that'll do. Can't put it back on the table. Hmm, I was thinking maybe we could use that to record the phone call, but it doesn't look like it. So we tried this guy, didn't we? Couldn't get anything from him. Let's go into here then. Here's my ticket. Give me a ride in that thing. Thank you, Monsieur. I hope you will find your trip to the bottom of the sea less detectable. Hopefully, I will. I mean, this is pretty cool. It's like full Bioshock, isn't it? Ooh. Can we... do anything? No. Well... Heavy. Monsieur has a way with work. Okay, so... We can we do anything with these? Those look like the controls to raise and lower the whatchamacallit. Hmm, okay. So we can't do Mr. anything with Uto? that. Oui. Uh, have you seen I'm Emmett Brown? For a friend of mine, Emmett Brown. Tall young guy, reddish brown hair. A distracted look. That's him. Any idea huh. where he went? He just passed fire with an older gentleman. I think they were added into the house of glass. Great, thanks. Oh, they went into the house of glass. That's that place upstairs, isn't it? Uh, we can't get anything from this guy because he doesn't like us. So they were not. Oh, there they are. Hey, Emmett, come out of there! Don't listen to him. What's that? Oh, it's like a secret passage. Perfect. Can we get into that bit? Does seem to be a different camera angle from the first time we went in. Welcome to the Atlas House of Glass, the future of domestic life. Okay, Emmett, let's get you out of here. Emmett! Emmett, don't listen to him. He, he's crazy. I'm still Bang on not the glass. sure about this business proposal, Mr. Sagan. Let me explain it again. Atlas Glass, 
unbreakable and soundproof. Oh. Soundproof. soundproof. Great. Our living space can be configured to be uh, of any Isn't it an extremely Data bad idea to meet your future self? Slide the walls in, or slide them out again to create a spacious banquet hall. Okay, so can we slide these walls around? No, that's locked. Right, so perhaps we've got to move the top one first. Maybe it's like a... I'm guessing it's a puzzle that involves getting the right combination of walls here. So can this one slide now? No, so we must have to go back up. Oh nice, I like these type of puzzles. This unusual. There's been some really unique puzzles in this game, actually. I've been pretty... pretty pleased at some of the puzzles we've had. Okay, hopefully now that will allow this one to slide. Yep, there we go, nice. Uh, now we slide this one. I'm guessing this probably won't slide. No, it will. Okay. There they are. What's that? Don't smell whatever that is. Oh, no. It's like chloroform or something. Damn it. Uh, okay, can we slide this? Yeah. Now let's slide the red one, I'm guessing. Yep. I'm not sure what that achieved, really. Uh, can we slide this one? We can. Okay, and now can we slide this last one? Yes, we can. Now, is there another one round here? Oh, damn, we've got to move the yellow wall. Oh, no, we haven't. It's a secret passage. Damn it. Where did you take him now, Doc? Oh, this is crazy, Next isn't it? Next up on our roster, a man who saw the possibilities in pond scum. Welcome, Ernest Philpot. Thanks, Trixie. Uh, oh, is that the guy with the, what do you call it? Yeah, the, the algae cakes. Right, has anyone seen where Emmett went? Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for a tall, thin, older gentleman. He might have been with a tall, thin, younger gentleman. I know just who you're talking about. Hey, just that. Got a minute ago. If you hurry, you might pass. That's Doc. That is not the guy who was there before. You know you're in there, Doc. Doc. Quit fooling around, Doc. What have you done with them? Stop! Help! I'm being Michael! It's not who he says he is. You can't assault the exhibitors. You don't understand. He's kidnapped Emmett. The boy is obviously I'll say he is. The one I should pull him out on his ear. That won't be necessary. Do you know who that is? That's Jacques Duteau of the Oceanic Institute. It isn't. No, it's not. It's... Please keep it down. The expo went through a lot of trouble and expense to secure Professor Duteau. We can't afford to antagonize him. If you've got a complaint yeah, against him, we can straighten it out after the show. But if you make another scene like that, I'm afraid I'm going to have you expelled from the hall. No, you're not. Because that is not Duteau. Professor Duteau, huh? At your service. Hmm. Where's the real Duteau? What have you done with the real Professor Duteau? I'm not sure I like your insinuations. We well, don't like sound even slightly Emmett. French, so. Perhaps I should call the authorities and have you removed from the hall. For what? Cold Asking questions? Guy, so. It's not against any rules. 
Take off your helmet. Take off your helmet. I prefer to leave it on. And the inland air is difficult on my sinus hands. Hmm. Convenient. What did you do with Emmett? Where did you stash Emmett? In a diving bell? It's called a bathosphere. Aha! So Emmett is uh -huh. in the bathosphere. I don't know what you're He just admitted it. About. Well, let me on it then. I think I'm going to take a closer look at that bathosphere. Not without a ticket. I'm afraid, of, sir. I've got tickets. Hey. Is this guy trying to bum a free ride? No. No, I've got tickets. See that you don't. Feels good to be on the right side of the law. <laughs> <laughs> Makes a nice change for him. Back off, Doc. Raise the bathosphere, Take man. Take a ride in a bathosphere. Your bathosphere. I'd like to see the inside of it. Can't get in without a ticket, I'm afraid. Well, I'm going to get a ticket then. You're not going to get away with this, you know. I'm guessing we're out of tickets. Okay, sera, sera. Mm, that's not French. Oh, no. Thank you, Ernest. Do be sure to that means by his book Parker's up next, and then Emmett. Cake. I have, and it was very interesting. Huh. I will be <laughs> back later to highlight another of our fine exhibitors. See you soon. I wonder if Trixie can give us some more tickets. Have we not got any left? Yeah, we have. What? We've got tickets. I'm just going to use this on the thing then. Here's my ticket. I want to see inside that bathosphere. I don't think so. Why? What do you mean? I've got a ticket. You have to honor my ticket. It's uh, uh, the, the wrong kind of ticket. Sorry. What are you I'll talking about? Break. So we need a special You're kind back. of ticket, apparently. You like to learn about the mysteries under the sea? Yeah, that's exactly what I want to learn about. Keep okay, up, so we need a new plan oh, of action to do this I'm thing, ten. clearly. Uh, we tried playing with this, didn't we? Huh, that's pretty cool. So, we need to find a way into there, don't we? Into that bathysphere. Um, question is, how are we going to do that? There's the phone booth. Maybe Trixie can help us out. And if not, then maybe Artie Hi, can. Trixie. Now what can I do you for? Emmett's in the bathosphere. See that bathosphere? Emmett's inside that bathosphere. That's nice. Nice? He's no, it's a not. captive. He's a prisoner. Of Jacques Duteau? Of Carl Sagan. Uh, I think I've got what you need. The Hill Valley Expo may prove overwhelming to those of a delicate disposition. If you are no, confused, that's not what's going on. Try these simple steps. One, put your head between your knees. Never mind. Thanks anyway. What? Thanks. Well, that didn't work. Next step, Artie. What's that? Bathysphere hose. Ooh, I wonder if we can do something with that. And if not, maybe the little little cogs and dials on the controls. I've, I think to do something with one of those, we've got to get Doc out of the equation. Let's quickly talk to Artie then. Hey, Artie. Uh, Emmett is trapped in the bathosphere. That's Carl Sagan in the deep sea diving suit, and he's holding Emmett captive in the bathosphere. You're making a pretty serious allegation, mister. I'll have to look into it right after the show. Really? Aquarium guy won't take my ticket. This ticket should get me into any exhibit on the floor, right? Sure. That's a P ticket. Well, the guy at the What's aquarium is refusing to honor it. Hmm. There must be some mistake. Come on, let's straighten this out. Yes. Professor Duteau, this young man claims you refuse to take his ticket. Not at all. I'm only too happy to take, to take his ticket. Please. We went a minute ago. And I will raise the bath and see. Right, so let's see if Emmett's in there then. My dear, what is the matter? The gears, uh, they must have become stuck. Oh, I'm that's convenient. I cannot raise the bathosphere at this moment. 
What a shame. Yes, it is, it is, it is. Well, I will work on the problem. Perhaps we should come back later. All very convenient. Hold down, please. Can we do something to this hose? Step back! You're gripping the hose! Why is that going to do something? What does it matter if there's nobody in the bathosphere? It's very bad form. Oh, sorry. The next exhibitor on our list is Officer Danny Parker of the Hill Valley Police Force. <laughs> Officer Parker is going to demonstrate a few of the many marvelous tools that our boys in blue will soon have at their disposal. The criminal element has truly met his match today. Officer Parker? Uh, it Parker? seems our next exhibitor is unavoidably detained, but I'm sure his presentation would have been both enlightening and exciting. Oh no, that means Emmett's up next. How about a round of applause just for the heck of it? Oh, we're really up against it now. Okay, we can click on Doc. Uh, raise the bathosphere. I know Emmett's in there. You know what Do you know what? When the air runs out to both of you. Oh uh, yeah, that's a point. I think we'll leave it there then, because that seems like a good place to end on a bit of a cliffhanger. So, as always guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time. It's as if you two were connected somehow.